A huge, huge game for the UWGB women's basketball team at the Crest Center. The first place Phoenix hosting also in first place Cleveland State. Winner pretty much can lock up the Horizon League regular season title. Phoenix won by 17 way back on January 14th, the last time these two faced off in Ohio. Let's jump to the second quarter. Freedom alum Callie Genke working it in the post. Gets it to go. Then don't blink. Bailey Butler steals the inbounds pass. Gets it to Cassie Shields who knocks down the jumper. Cleveland State with the answer. Destiny Leo, a walking bucket. The conference's leading scorer with the basket. Vikings led by two at the half. Third quarter, still a back and forth game. Bailey Butler kicks it to Schiltz. Gets all three of these. Then Natalie McNeil off the bench, gets going. Drives and scores to put the Phoenix up five. But again, the Vikings answered every Phoenix run. Carmen Villalobos beats the buzzer, cuts it back down to two. Fourth quarter, though, is all Green Bay. McNeil again coming up clutch. Then with the Phoenix up nine, Sidney Levy the dagger. Green Bay pulls away to win it by 15. Sports director Brandon Kinnard has more from the Crest Center. After five long years, the Phoenix are on top of the Horizon League once again. And in a season when they've had to have so many different players step up, perhaps it's fitting Natalie McNeil drove them to victory in the biggest game of the year. A season high 16 points for the junior forward, nearly a dozen better than her season average. She feasted in the middle of the Cleveland State defense. We just had to look for what spots were open and what was going to work. And um, I mean, I like being in the middle. I like that's my favorite spot to be on the floor. So. I think we moved the ball really well, especially out of the middle and then getting to the corner um, and just looking to get our shots that we know we're going to hit. You know, Natalie can attest to the fact that these, they're always chirping, they're always talking to one another, they're always you know, trying to do things to make them better and it's not something that a, a coaching staff can tell them. You either have it in you or you don't and I think we've got some good leadership top to bottom and all of them have bought into that so it's pretty fun to be around that. After the game, McNeil called this a dream come true, saying you come to a program like this for big games like this, but also stay down to earth, reminding everyone they're far from done yet. They still need to win the conference tournament to get an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. That Horizon League tournament begins next Thursday with the quarterfinal game right here at the Crest Center. In Green Bay, Brandon Kinnard, NBC 26 Sports.